still tracking a data breach involving the Tehama County Department of Social Services. Action News Now reporter Lauren Cooper spoke with the county about what it's doing to help the victims of the hack. If you live in Tehama County, you may have gotten a letter from the Tehama County Administration letting residents know there has been a data breach. The letter says a hacker accessed people's names, birthdays, social security numbers, and more from the Tehama County Social Services Department between November of 2021 and April of 2022. Tehama County Chief Administrator Gabe Heydrich explained why it took so long to notify the victims. Once we identify that there's an issue and potential information has been compromised, then we bring in forensic experts and they do the work to understand how it happened, what happened, what was compromised. Depending upon the amount, we could be looking at gigs or terabytes of information. It's been over a year since the hack. Um, oftentimes, stuff like this is kind of planted and it's kind of like a sleeper cell and it'll have to be initiated. The county says there's still no suspect. They've reworked their security measures, but the community is still shaken. That's kind of scary because um, people's information are out there and possibly mine. I did not know about that. People could commit fraud or use your social security number. As of now, there's been no reports of fraud related to the hack, and the county is offering free credit monitoring for a year to anyone impacted. In Tehama County, Lauren Cooper with Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. Now, if you suspect your information was stolen, file a report with police.